Hello YouTube, this is Omidant here, bringing another Perk Bottles from Crawlers episode. This time we're going to be looking at explosive weapons and how effective they are at getting perks. Now, as I'm sure you'll know by now, it's the way to get perks from the Crawler zombies on Die Rise without using knife only is to get 100% accuracy. This applies for all weapons, but depending on what classification of weapon they are, there are different rules as to what counts as 100% accuracy. This episode, I'm going to be looking at explosive weapons to see how they're affected by their classification, because they fire projectiles, not hit scans, and their explosive radius, how does this affect what count as a hit or not. So in this first clip, as you can see, using Mustang Sally, um, for now I'm classing this an explosive weapon. Some people have said it's a wonder weapon type of weapon, but I guess it's an explosive. So all shots from the Mustang and Sally will either hit or injure uh, one of the crawlers in this round, but there is no perk dropped. Now, here is another piece of footage, um, again using Mustang and Sally, but this time, um, at a one point, I'll slow it down now, um, I fire two shots from each pistol, so there's two shots out, they both explode, but only one d 10 points appears, therefore one hit and injured one of the crawlers, but the other missed. However, at the end of the footage, as you can see, a perk is still appears. Bit confusing, really. However, in the rest of the footage that we've recorded using explosive weapons, mostly the Mustang and Sally, but the RP key as well, it seems as though hitting the target, even if you just injure it, does count as a hit and, well, get you the perk. This makes explosives fairly useful for um, getting the perk, seeing as they have a large blast radius, which means even if you don't hit the zombie, you know, you will injure them enough to count as a successful hit. Also note for the RP key footage, there's an unusual number of zombies in the round, only five to six spawn normally but in this round a huge number spawn far more than that this is because um i accidentally joined my friend when he was playing this game at the start of the round and then left immediately but however this but this however triggered a larger number of zombies to spawn in the round meaning that he had a lot more to deal with when he was using his rpg uh, doesn't really have much relevance except it makes it harder to get 100 percent accuracy so it might be a good way to Troll your friends, possibly. I swear I didn't do it intentionally. Yeah. So, in conclusion, um, rockets and explosive weapons seem to be more unreliable than other types of weapons in terms of what is or was not a hit. Seemingly clean runs from the um, an explosive only round will give you no perks, and apparent misses may sometimes go un unnoticed and give you the perk itself. Therefore, for people who really want to be getting these extra perks early in the rounds before the difficulty increases, um, explosive can't really be recommended because they're quite unreliable. But overall, they seem like a decent way for getting these abilities, certainly more than other types of weapons. This has been Elm Agent. Thank you for watching, and goodbye.